A documentary on King Charles' coronation has been slapped with almost 900 complaints. Over the Christmas period, the BBC aired Charles III, the coronation year, focusing on the moments leading up to the coronation of King Charles and Queen Camilla, as well as the moments after. However, some have claimed the documentary only shone a positive light on the royal family. On Boxing Day, viewers tuned in to witness moments of the coronation rehearsal, including His Majesty advising Justin Welby, GCVOPC, the Archbishop of Canterbury on how to place both the Imperial State Crown and the St. Edward's Crown on his head. Since the programme aired, the BBC has compiled a list of the complaints which were received between December 18 and 31. Overall, the BBC Audience Services, Stage 1, received over 2,600 complaints. In total, the Coronation documentary received 897, over one-third of the grand total. People complained to the corporation for showing bias in favor of the monarchy. The network stated that complainants felt the tone was overly positive. In response, the BBC said, Charles III, The Coronation Year is a one-off observational documentary that covers a period of historical significance when the king took on new duties and prepared for the first coronation in this country for 70 years. It has unique access and captures personal moments as the king adapts to his new role. Editorial control is retained by the BBC. The BBC seeks to reflect a range of viewpoints in news and current affairs coverage of the monarchy. Earlier in 2023, when documenting the coronation, Panorama on BBC One examined the structures and finances that surround the royal family and featured a newly commissioned poll about attitudes to the monarchy. On Radio 4, the Today programme had a debate on whether the UK needs a monarchy and the world this weekend looked at its future. Overall, we have explored a range of perspectives on the monarchy and will continue to do so. Throughout the documentary, viewers saw a side to their majesties and the rehearsals that would have previously been off-limits, including private moments with their relatives at Buckingham Palace and Westminster Abbey. The documentary also included interviews with the Princess Royal, as well as Annabelle Elliot, the sister of Queen Camilla, who was seen wiping away a tear after her sister and the King were taken to the Abbey on the day of the coronation. Follow Mirror Celebs on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube and Threads.